Now, I have told a lot of people that I love the Storm Collectibles Tekken 7 line. It, it's Tekken. It's my favorite fighting game franchise of all time. Like, honestly, there's a lot to talk about because Storm Collectibles produces the best fighting game figures you've ever seen. They've done King of Fighters. They've done Mortal Kombat. They've done Street Fighter. Like, they're doing World Heroes Perfect. They've announced Samurai Showdown and Darkstalkers, and they're doing Golden Axe and Gears of War. That's a lot of licenses under your belt, and it can be very uh, frustrating to get out some of the figures that people want you to get out because of all the other stuff that you have to get out of the way, like pre-orders and such. That's the main reason why certain figures are taking as long as they do, because Storm has so many licenses acquired under their belt and makes it harder for their fans to get the figure that they really want because l listen I I'm crazy okay I, I check whenever Storm posts something on Instagram I have their notifications on so when I see Jin I'm gonna go crazy because I'm waiting for that day to come I'm waiting for the day that I wake up in the morning I check on Storm's Instagram and then I see Jin announced finally like that that will make my year and I'll be, like, I'm really excited to see what they're going to do with Jin. I'm really excited because that's going to look so good. But off topic of my fantasies for a moment, like, that's going to take a while because of their licenses. Now, my prayers for Tekken figures from them have finally come true in, at the New York Comic Con in 2017, where they showed off Heihachi. Now, man, judging from this photo, first time I've laid eyes upon it, I was just in all ecstatic because man there you have never seen a better Heihachi than this like never has there ever been a better Heihachi Mishima figure than this by Storm like it is outstanding work the paint is phenomenal the sculpt is absolutely amazing every detail from head to toe is just perfect all around very needless to say I was very excited to get him. And what I did, god damn. It felt so good to hold a Tekken figure with so much detail and time and effort put into it. I couldn't have been any happier. Alright, alright, fine. He wasn't first shown off at New York Comic Con. He was shown off at SDCC of 2017. Now sure, he was just a prototype, but wow. How amazing is this to see what he has become. It's phenomenal. And February of 2018, holy shit! My favorite character, Kazuya, finally has a Storm figure. And no effort was lost whatsoever. Kazuya, as a prototype, looks fantastic. Like, I wish I can own the prototype. Um, cause this figure is absolutely fucking gorgeous. Every detail, like Heihachi, is captured. The Storm always uses 100% authentic paint, sculpt, and everything. Kazuya, oh my god, I was so excited for Kazuya when he came out. It's just, he's my favorite Tekken character, other than Jin, and I was so happy when this guy finally released because he turned out fucking amazing. This prototype, this prototype image right here is phenomenal. I, I loved it this figure. And of course the final product never disappoints. Kazuya's gloves look absolutely spot on, the chest scar, the scars all around his body, the pants, the flame decals, everything is just so good. After that they released a special edition of Kazuya referencing Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection's maroon color. Heihachi also got a special edition and a SDCC figure. Everything is going well for the Tekken line. But there's only one problem. Who's next? Well, here's your answer. Who's that you see? Jin? Devil Jin? I went crazy. I went absolutely nuts and made a Storm Collectibles Tekken video because I was so excited to see Jin and Devil Jin unannounced. But here they are at the event and oh my god I just went crazy over it I, I couldn't believe my eyes 
finally, a Jin, an accurate Jin figure, an accurate Devil Jin figure. Like, I, what else could you ask for? You can finally finish out the Mishima line with the two, probably the two best characters in the Tekken franchise, Jin Kazama and Devil Jin. This is nuts. Um, now here's the kicker. Now, I check the Storm Collectibles Instagram religiously because you never know when they're going to pop out a figure that you haven't seen in a while or they haven't really shown off yet. Um, so if you guys are patiently waiting for Jin like I am and want to see when he's going to come out, I suggest you follow Storm on Instagram and uh, you check and check like I do because... I have a feeling that he's gonna be shown very soon. Like how they teased Jin here before San Diego Comic Con. It was July 16th of 2019 and god damn here he is as a teaser. Like I, god I lost my shit. I always lose my shit whenever I see a Tekken figure release. Especially if it's of my second favorite character Jin. Like, look at this dude. This is probably my most anticipated action figure release of all time because, my god, I I couldn't believe it. Like, they've already made really outstanding versions of Kazuya Heihachi, and now here comes Jin with Devil Jin on the way. It's, man, it's insane. This picture still holds up as probably the most hyped I've ever been for an action figure like it is insane and when he was shown off I was just waiting so much for them to show him at an event like I didn't care what event it was I just wanted him to be shown off and he was he was shown off at San Diego Comic Con of this year and oh, Jesus Christ just looking at him now just makes me even more excited and I just want him to be released but on that note, he looks, again, fucking amazing. Like, uh, I never thought they'd be able to do it. Like, look at this. The gauntlets are perfectly sculpted and accurately done. The pants are absolutely phenomenal. The flame design, the hair, the, fi mm, the face looks all right. It was updated better at the Wonder Festival. But he looks so damn good, obviously. He looks so good. Like, this is insane. How amazing this figure turned out. This is his prototype. This is Jin's prototype. And it, it, like, it looks so good. Every attention to detail is 100% represented in this prototype. They have put so much effort into this figure. Just like Mikaze and Heihachi from before. Jin looks amazing. And 100% accurate to the source material. Now, this prototype has been fixed. And wow! Holy shit! This, this is the probably the final product of what Jin is going to look like from Storm Collectibles. And man, I couldn't be more impressed than I have been before with Kazuya and Heihachi. Like, seeing Jin's first prototype was crazy enough, but seeing this, this, they have fixed the hair, they fixed the face because some people complained about it. Like, wow, it, it's perfect. Again, I, I can't stress it enough. It is 10 out of 10. This Jin is 10 out of 10. It is the best Jin figure of all time. And same can be said for Kazuya and Heihachi. It's been three months since July. Here we are, patiently waiting, anticipating for Jin Kazama to finally be shown, to finally be on pre-order, so I can rush onto their website, pre-order him the first chance I see him, and that's the end of that. I will be so happy the day I wake up in the morning, Storm Collectibles posted a photo, what is it? It's Jin Kazama, finally coming out, and it would be so amazing. I would just go crazy, like... Nobody understands how insanely hyped I am about this one figure. 
Because just like with Kazuya and Hihachi, like, this has been anticipated for a long time. We haven't had any good Tekken figures in a very, very long time. And even if we did, they're not as good as Storm Collectibles. Play Arts Kai tried with Kazuya and Jun. They abandoned it. Storm has not abandoned it. They are keeping the line going. They are perfecting each and every figure they touch from every single franchise they grab the license to, and they are just knocking it out of the park. One day, he will be shown. If you somehow managed to survive 10 minutes of me rambling about Storm Collectibles and Tekken, please make sure to drop a like and support Tekken 7 and Storm Collectibles. What figure would you like to see from the Storm Collectibles Tekken line? Please drop it in the comments below. Thank you very much. And let's go, Jin! <laughs>